वेलकम टू कॉमर्स अकेडमी इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी डिस्कस फॉर्मेट ऑफ इनकम स्टेटमेंट सो टू डे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस फॉर्मेट ऑफ बैलेंस शीट वॉट इज बैलेंस शीट बैलेंस शीट इज अ स्टेटमेंट ऑफ एसिट्स लाइबिलिटी एंड कैपिटल विच इज यूज टू चेक द फाइनेंशियल पोजिशन ऑफ बिजनेस so format of balance sheet is one side is assets and other side is liability so here we record all current assets and fixed assets here current liability and long term liability so first we record current assets cash in hand account receivable account receivable is our current assets prepaid All prepaid expenses are our current assets. So next clothing, raw material, clothing, working process. So clothing, finish. All receivable income means accrued income, our current asset. so cash our current assets account receivable prepaid all prepaid expenses closing raw material closing work in process closing finished goods and all receivable income our current asset so amount is next long fixed assets fixed fixed assets our building plant furniture furniture machine etc so it's our fixed asset so that is our asset side first current assets include all current assets mentioned in current assets portion and all fixed assets mentioned in fixed assets so here current liability current current liability so 
Not compatible. All outstanding expense. Outstanding expense means that expense which uh, we not pay. It's pay pay in future. Outs. All advance income, that income that we receive but not earn, means a tuition fee we received in advance but it's not earned until the completion of month. So all advance income is our liability until we not earn it. So all advance income is our front liability. So. So next one long term life. Long term liability. Then again. Day nothing. Add net profit. If net profit is there, in case of loss, in case of loss, it less from. So that is our liability side. So both sides of balance sheet, asset side and liability side balance are equal. So, front liability or uh, long term liability in capital we add net profit. If the net loss, then we less from the capital. And by all total of these balances and all total of these balances must be equal. So, this is the format of balance sheet. In next lecture, we discuss this format with an example. So, keep learning and uh, watch this lecture again. And if so that if you understand this format, you can make a balance sheet of any question. So must be remembered and focus on this format. We meet in next lecture. Thank you and goodbye.